Community, community, community. Why is everyone talking about community right now? Specifically, community strategy. So in a recent video on TikTok created by the founder of Twitch, Justin Kahn, he says that community strategy is just as important as product strategy in 2022. And while I fully agree with him there, his definition of community strategy is confusing at best and harmful at worst. He states that community is about a founder creating a brand around their personality and then launching a discord so they can talk to people. Ugh. This is the tip of the iceberg when it comes to community building. And not only that, but it's actually kind of dangerous to think about cults of personality as being our basis for community building. So let's talk about what a healthy and non-harmful community strategy should contain and what it really even means. So first, let's define the word strategy. Strategy is just a set of guiding principles that helps you make decisions. And not only helps you make decisions, but helps your team make decisions. If you're a CEO or a leader, you can distribute responsibility and trust that people have a framework for making really good decisions. Your strategy should help distinguish you in a noisy marketplace and help you determine what distinct activities you're going to pursue as an organization. The term strategy has a long history in the business context. Well, long in relative terms. So back in 1996, Michael E. Porter wrote a fantastic piece for Harvard Business Review called What is Strategy? that really sets out what it means in the business context because it was often being mistaken for operations. Now, this isn't the final word on strategy. Another Michael, Michael D. Watkins, wrote an article in 2007 expanding upon that definition and bringing it more in alignment with how we think about strategy today. And even that is still not the final word. There are many schools of thought around what strategy is. So I highly recommend going to Harvard Business Review and checking out all of their strategic articles if you want to get really nerdy about that concept. But again, boiled down, strategy is just a set of guiding principles for making aligned decisions. Okay, so we got strategy. What is community? A lot of people don't define this term when they talk about it and it turns into a bunch of wishy-washy nothing, okay? So when I talk about community, what I talk about is a set of people who share mutual concern for one another. And that set of people often is bound by a shared identity, interest, location, something that they have in common. A brand community is a group of people who share mutual concern who are stewarded by a brand. It's just that simple. So let's smash those two things together. A community strategy is just a set of guiding principles that helps you decide how you're gonna create something different with your community. It helps you decide the exact activities you should be doing, the content and programming you should be doing, but it doesn't get into those exact activities. It stays high level. It is that set of guiding principles that helps you create a unique community that can stand out in the crowd. If you have a community strategy, it means that you're not going to create just a cult of personality. You're going to be creating values-based bonds. And it's not going to be all about what you get out of it. It's going to be about what everyone gets out of it. It's a system of mutual shared value and mutual shared concern for one another. If you don't have a set of guiding principles for your community, what ends up happening is the experience is really random and disjointed for your community members, which means that whatever you're trying to glean from the community, whatever you're trying to create with the community is going to also be random and misaligned. So while I agree with Justin Kahn that community strategy is just as, if not more important than product strategy in 2022, I disagree with the idea that you should create a cult of personality around who you are as a founder or who you are as a community builder. That is just plain dangerous. So what sets you and your community apart from everything else that's out there? Having a community strategy means you're creating something that is scalable and valuable to all involved, which means that you're helping participate in a regenerative future. So have fun out there. Make sure that you're operating with this set of guiding principles and don't believe the bullshit.